All right, we are a go. We are rolling and bowling, bro. Ah. Yep, it's another Sudeku stream slash episode. If you're watching this on YouTube, welcome to the episode. If you're watching this live, I would know because you'd be here. All righty. Picking up where we left off, we had some shit that we needed to do. We were, we were with the, for some reason, evil Australian versions of ourselves. I don't know how much game there is left, actually. I actually think there's, like, very little left. No entry here. Like, we're pretty much, I believe, at the end. It's a little My sad, but like I said, this is a short mode. game. How can I help you? Ah, forget it. You're beyond help. Just buy something and get out of here. Why should it be so mean? I've already maxed out health and power. I honestly don't need more. Higher essence equals more damage on that. Maybe I'll look at that. So I found out, by the way, because I was watching other Let's Plays of this game, that if you're hitting someone and then you like quickly tab like that, you'll actually um call me Ripplet. Oh. I, I mean, like, I should theoretically spend money to upgrade these other people, but I really... CBF, we're just gonna play Tal, and the rest can just deal with their own shit. I'm not spending money upgrading their gear. I forget what our main quest was. Spell this right. Good. Oh, we have two towels on the team. That's actually so unfortunate. Well, at least some things about this never changes. There it is. 
Yeah, just unlock me. I can use it. Actually, I really could use a healing potion right now. Now you unlock. Die, Caprine, die. why we need the help of a Hiskillian on this mission. If it means we succeed in our mission, it will be worth it. I don't know near. Stop being a little bitch. That was a star flare vial. So real quick.
Oh, Nico's down. These guys are so much shittier. Wish Elko was here. Damn, these guys have bad skills. <laughs> what is the map? I'm already lost. What direction do I want to go? He went to the grotto. <laughs> now that's to the citadel. Where the fuck are we going? Well, how does that count as... Oh, okay. So much damage. Maybe I should have upgraded their gear. These guys are hopeless. Best viewer is on, and then it's like just blocked out. Skipper booming. Man, rest in peace, the guy's account got lost just for that shit. I'm a little bit lost, actually. Like, where the fuck are we going? It feels like I'm going further away from where I'm supposed to be going. Please be a quickie. Oh, there you are. I think it's this way.
That one was not as bad. I'm not sure why they went with the aesthetic that the reverse of medieval was Australian, but like, you better give them credit. It's a, like it's kind of original, I guess. Like, it's not good, but it's it's original. I don't know why I even bother ever doing the long combos. I've literally never had them work. To leveling these dudes up. Might as well. Wait, he doesn't have blade dance. Of like all the items to have except the like one that you want the most. First, yeah, first and only, by the way. Good to see Ajak. I think this is the area we want to go to. Is there even anything of worth over there? I, we're gonna get into a fight, but I just want to see if there's anything like valuable over here. Would they put something behind the waterfall or lava fall? If that's what you want to call it. Oh, that was a giant waste of time. There's probably supposed to be something here. So if that takes you to the stronghold, what the fuck are these things? Where do these take you? Tree of Woe. Sure. Let's check it out. Is it me or is it starting to like lag a bit? I'm gonna start deleting some saves. I wonder if this is one of those kinds of games where it doesn't handle having a lot of saves very well.
Meme generator band skipper. Best viewers on Shut the Fuck Up. <laughs> Very nice. Well, we're getting like $250 from these trays. It's actually kind of depressing. What was the point of coming here? Oh, this was the point. Okay, fuck this. It's like... SECOND! got a weapon upgrade. What does this one do? Oh, protect at the start of the combat for free. I'll be honest, I'm pretty sure what we have is already the best. Because you are it's literally we're immune to every status effect. I think being immune to every status effect is just something that would always be more valuable in like pretty much every situation. Could be. I'm sure there's other situations where I could be wrong, but a little bit of extra um, shielding isn't worth, you know, not being immune to every status effect. Can't be stunned, can't be slowed, can't be poisoned. That just seems more valuable to me. Kind of tired of, like, having full inventory with this shit because, like... You have to scroll for like every person you want to use, which is a little tedious. And what the fuck is that thing? Oh, it's the rabbit people. Yo, what's going on? Welcome, friends. It is good to see some friendly faces out here. I am Shara of the Bareki tribe. I have been studying the various types of monsters that live here. Wow, in the you desert. look like Maybe a corpse. Maybe I could give you some advice. Are you sure? Well, I know the lost creatures do not come from this world. They are nomads that slipped into a Gloria as the light faded and the void edged ever closer. Did she say edging? Beware the weird warlord. They are very strong creatures and can regenerate. There are some skeletal creatures here in Devil's Belch Canyon that cannot be killed in the normal way. They will. There is a snake like creature known as a scribe. A type of scribe exists. Blood neck. Good luck. Welcome. Why are you so shiny? I have been studying these creatures since the Bareki tribe ceased to function as a collective. I believe the creatures, the light, and the lack of cohesion in. Well, I know the lost creatures do not come. Oh, and then it just repeats. Kind of, I'm kind of sad for them. Whoa, don't get up into the camera like that, Jesus. That's scared chat. Scared the viewer. Scared me. You know, I just realized the weapon that we use, it just looks like a... It looks like a butter knife. Like a really blue, big butter knife. Looks this like is the is. shrine of Elifetes. Rest ye who enter. Oh, thanks. That was, that was loud. Yeah, she hit the wall and she never really recovered. Oh, that's nice. They just give you a shrine to just full heal at. 
very forgiving. Yeah, this game's audio levels are giga fucked. It always cracks me up when I play old games and then you have people murmuring, but they set the music to like 200%. Maybe maybe it worked different on like CRTVs. Maybe old TVs, you know, functioned better. Well, I have to admit, Tal, you can handle a sword. In the Elite Guard, we learned to love the art of swordsmanship. You still have a way to go to catch up with Kazel. You still need a way to do it. I'm literally better than Kazel. Kazel wishes he was me. Putting a lot of trust in you, Hiskillian. I feel the same way about you, Eclorian. Wow. All, all seven lines of dialogue that they have in the game place right there. Again, party banter, I said it like I've already said this before, but party banter is the best way to make your game feel alive. Just put a shit ton of party banter in your game if you ever make an RPG. Just an ungodly amount of party banter. And your game will feel like it's actually well written. That's all it takes. Why is it snowy over here? It's literally like one meter from the burning pits of hell. Oh, we did it! Oh, wait, thank the lord. We don't have to walk back every time. Can I take them to my world? Would they like my world? I wonder. Would that be rubbing it in? Do you think, hey, here's my non-shitty, non-decrepit world? New Bratwater. Chanzentia, Illumina, Temple of Mo, Crystal Reef, Devil's Belch, Chlorian Stronghold. Wait, I, I, thought, I thought I was going to take him to. By the way, I did my tax return today. 3k on the tax return. Easy. How much you guys getting back on your tax return? Hopefully a lot. This only applies if you're Australian. I, not only did I... I do my tax return, I like legit was claiming like everything, bro. Claim my PC, my... I mean, granted, I work from home, so I can't claim that shit. But I just... I made sure that I was not missing a single thing. What the hell is that noise? Oh. Is that meant to be, like, is that supposed to be Blizzard? Did he expose himself with tax evasion? Nah. Remember I said I work from home so I can't claim these things. Nice try, Mr. Taxman. I wish you could claim gas. Imagine how much your tax return would be if you could claim gas. Can you claim a game as a tax? Nah. You know what's funny? I, I looked it up. Streamers can actually claim games as a tax. Not me, because I'm not like a real streamer. But like, I looked up and like, Summit one g was like talking like he, he claimed like games and he bought his tax. As like work expenses, which you can do. But I'm not like a real full-time streamer, so I can't play these. I mean, not that I've really bought any games. Like, the, I've bought these cheapo garbage games that are like five dollars, like chained together and lethal company, as opposed to like anything that would really classify as an expense. I haven't bought any AAA games, so sad.
Anything shown on stream can be claimed as tax. Yeah, but sadly, like I said, not a real stream. This blizzard is killing my head. Yeah, how loud is the... That's like the most awful blizzard sound noise thing I've ever heard. It just sounds like... It just sounds like farts. I'll turn it down for you guys. That shit is awful. The sound guy was like... De the sound guy was definitely just like chilling out. When that, that they made that section. I did claim my Twitch subscription, so it's probably. But that was only like, how much is it? like ten dollars? I can't believe I've been subscribed to Angus for like nine months now. I was like, wow, what a waste of nine, what a waste of uh, like ten dollars, or is it like ninety dollars? Yeah, I put them as mental health services. <laughs> Spooky stream helps me get through the day. And Angus's stream just make me feel better about my life. I just would deny that. He would. Yeah, sometimes when I'm working, I'll actually put, like, Spooker's stream on, like, like, play on the background while I'm working, like, from the last night, like, the previous VOD. Assuming I'm trying to like make a walkway or some shit. Oh, I see what I'm trying to do. Oh, that's wired. Dom had the same problem as I did last night. Weird. What problem does he have? Guy's having a lot of technical issues lately, by the way. ISP cut out? puzzle. This was a very tedious puzzle. I was mid-watching stream and then it suddenly turned off. Consider that a blessing, my friend.
A lot of tech problems have been happening recently. Yeah, but they're usually, um, they're usually all consolidated within iTunes streams, not ours. There we go, Nico. Kim Jong Un sent out an EMP. Yeah, he hit. He sent out the hitters. He sent out the shooters. He said, enough's enough. Can't have Angus desecrating my beloved nation. And he sent out the shooters to shut down everyone's streams. It's only a matter of time. Wait, where are we going? Oh yeah, we don't need to go back there. We opened this shit. Kazel, wait, I'm a friend of Scientine, don't attack. My name is Cool and I'm still served with Korean full mouth. So they don't understand that these troops have become ever more paranoid as the light has faded from our sky. I can help you get into the compound proper by opening the port colors below. Commander Garen is a virtual true sight to sheep, but be warned. He believes Vescali has burned the Pokemon so we've had and he's determined exactly what he sees as his revenge. What do you mean? Can oh, I skipped it. You can use the lever to open the door in the courtyard. Seek out blah blah blah. He'll remember a time before the darkness and he'll help you as much as he can. Good luck. Alright, well, we're putting sound effects back on because I'm not doing the voice uh, over again. Oh my god, it's so loud. I'm sorry, chat. You're just going to have to live with this. I don't know why they designed it like that. Do you regret your actions now? It's not my fault. It's the game's fault for being so poorly designed. I, I just... I don't know. I really don't know. Look, the further we get from the from the gate, the less obnoxious it is. Ringing the fucking bell. Wait, do we have to kill them before they run to the bell? Is that what this, like, whole thing is? Oh, that's actually cringe. There's one running for the bell. Oh no, he made it to the bell! He's immune to the fucking attack! What is this? I 
see you running for it. No, don't let it get the Oh, thank god. Okay, hold up the other one. Don't let him get to it. I can't believe that was a section. And I, th this was not helpful. Well, everyone is just standing there. Jerking off. Another one of these. Was that the gate we came through, or was this the gate we came through? Okay. Door needs a key to unlock it. What? Let's just make this quick. Jump across that little ledge? Come on, bro. Up. Oh. Huh, soldiers? You're not from this regiment. Come to put an end to all this, have you? Don't worry, I don't serve Garen. Caprine is still my liege. We have come on orders of Caprine. 
Garen has committed treason against Scientine and continues to mislead you and your comrades. <laughs> if only things were that simple. Out here in the hinterlands, madness is rife. Do you really believe these unorganized boys can ever make a dent on the armies of Heskilia? The forces you send fight with valor, but they seem to be in a state of berserk. There's no thought or plan to their attacks. They're but children, raging at the dying of light. There will be no tears shed for Garen and his treachery against Cyantine once the light returns. You see, when the light disappeared, it took sense and empathy with it. This is why Garen disobeyed Caprine and attacked Haskilia. Please, do what you must, but don't blame the honest foot soldiers. They cannot see their actions for what they really are. So sad. Can we get an F in the chat? We are here to reclaim the vessel of true sight. We have no wish to fight. If Garen is allowed to continue as he has been, then more young men will die. Garen stays locked away in the north courtyard. A heavy gate bars the way in. The gate's mechanism is protected by magic. And the door itself is held shut by huge counterbalance weights. If you can hold... Good luck on your... Can we rest in here? Okay, alright, fuck it. I already know. We're pulling out the blade dance. We ain't even five seconds in, we're pulling out the blade dance. Welcome in, Spookers. What the fuck is an amaranth? Oh, dude, it's amaranth's pee! Oh, dude, Pogger, dude, I got, to, I finally got to drink amaranth's pee. Let's go. Sorry, right, none for you, chat. Amaranth's pee restores health completely. That makes sense to me. Aw oh, man, this we this weapon looks cooler than my current weapon. Unfortunately, my current weapon is stronger. Why did we even come in here? Okay, it looks like the counterbalance is up there. <laughs> I'll 
handle that. You can... Oh, thank God. I thought they were going to... I thought Tao was going to stay behind. That would have been annoying. Alright, so how does this puzzle work? I need... That doesn't seem so complicated. Just push this up. And then push this here. And then we're done, aren't we? Boom, boom. Wait, I can't... Oh, it needs to be... That is so stupid. Wow. That is... What? And then I need this out of the way. Okay. Oh, I see. Oh, it's going to be like this. I see where I'm, where this is going. So I need to... Oh, I know how this is gonna go. Oh, this is awful. Wait, this is the first puzzle they've actually put in the game that actually was, like, low-key required a little bit of thinking. Most of the puzzles up until now have just been, like, brain-dead. Okay. Oh, uh, I mean, it's not that bad, honestly. That was actually kind of a interesting, I guess, interesting-ish puzzle. So what is up here? What is the purpose of being able to come up here? There we go. Oh, that's what I need. Oh, okay, I need to... I think I need to pull this one. There. And then... Now I am actually a little confused. I think I've lost the plot. Oh no, I haven't. Or have I? How the fuck am I supposed to push this one in? Oh, I need this one out of the way, so I have to... Oh, this actually is a little bit harder than I gave credit for. So I need this one out of the way. Which does in fact mean I need you to be there. And then I sh should be able to just... Wait, no, but I need to be able to walk through here when it comes through. And then, can I, is this 
just let me... Shit. Brother, what is this? Oh, come on, man. Oh, that's not so bad. Bridge. 
Oh no, I skipped Nico dialogue. There's no way you don't immediately move. What are you doing? I just made the path for you. Oh, I have to complete the path before you go. That's cringe. You know, this camera angle really doesn't help, because I have no idea if I'm actually, like, grabbing onto the things or not. It would be cool if we would, like, were allowed to first person. That would help a lot. Holy moly. Like, like, I, like I feel like the game actively hates you. If this was modern gaming, they would have given me like 17 hits by now. They would have been like, what if you move the individual block on the left to the right? That would probably help solve the issue. That's why I don't play modern games. She, like, just teleported. This puzzle can actually just like literally suck my cock. Oh 
Holy shit, this puzzle is literally designed to be as annoying as possible. Everything about this puzzle is, like, fucking bad. So I think I've literally trapped myself. Puzzle was like made in like Indochina or some shit. To like torture innocent people. That should not have taken as much effort as it did. That was literally more, that was less of a puzzle than me more just fighting the camera perspective, actually. This is it. I will stay here and hold the counterbalance. You go and see if you can get the gate to open. I will. Am I about to solo fight another boss? If these two are holding the counterbalance, and then the second, I need the girl to do the magic dispel. Wait, it's actually about to make me solo fight. That puzzle was doo doo far. That puzzle was doo doo far. Very doo doo and very far. No good. But it's okay, I, like I said in the last episode, I beat Professor Layton on the Nintendo DS, so I'm a puzzle bot. Please don't make us fight anyone here. Oh, thank God. Evil Ailish wears more clothes. That can't be a coincidence. Be careful what you say. The cock is watching. He ain't taking no prisoners tonight. Keep them cheeks tight. Be careful what you say. The cock is watching. He ain't taking no prisoners tight. Keep them cheeks tight. You're such a cheapskate. You didn't put that through the TTS. You made me read it. Oh, by the way, the anime reward is finally done. It's mostly just a temp. It's not really a great anime reward. But the anime reward does have an actual function now. It's no longer just empty and you get scammed. Come from Scientine to reclaim the vessel of true sight. Hand it over, and I will let you go home. Help Scientine keep their pathetic system afloat. We have our own way of life. Hijacked says, Be careful what you say. Crossed fingers, crossed fingers, crossed fingers, crossed fingers, crossed fingers, crossed fingers. I regret is watching. Chicken, 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 fire, 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 fire. Fire, he ain't taking no prisoners tonight. Chicken, 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 chicken. See what you did? Chicken, the TTS pissed off the monster. Tight. Tongue, tongue, praying gesture, oh my God, praying gesture. Terrifying. Be careful what you say. Crossed I fingers, did on a cutscene, I didn't even fingers, care. Crossed I mean, fingers, we're just fighting crossed some... fingers, crossed fingers, crossed fingers. The cock is watching. Chicken, chicken, chicken. <laughs> oh my God, what the hell is that? Fight this thing. Okay, I think I'm supposed to like break the shields and then he, he does his little laser attacks. I think it's just two. I think he only does two.
And then we do Blade Dance. That did nothing. Okay, now do I Blade Dance? Oh, I was supposed to hit him from behind. Wow, that did literally like four damage. Okay, I gotta get out of there. Oh, that's whack. Dude, that's so whack. Is that it? Like, is that really all the time I get to hit him? Oh, I get two. I need to get the fuck out of there. Okay, so I get two shots to hit him. Okay. Dude, he is actually... Cr this is like the first monster we've encountered that is like... Actually scary. I don't know, the face does not help. swing. Honestly, I could probably run for it and get it now. Okay, yeah, I don't even have to wait. I don't know why I was, like, taking so much time. This actually feels so out of place for the rest of the game. This thing, like, looks terrifying. Get slapped on. Ugh. Ew. Please. My creature. My beautiful creature. Must say, Anton and Askelia joined together to kill old Garrett? Yes. Was I not a good man once? Maybe. You seek revenge, Garrett. But I seek truth. I have no need to kill you. You are a pitiful husk of a man. One day when the light returns, you will understand. Really? We're going to do that? I'm not going to kill you? Like we didn't just kill like 50 million of his men? It's done. I am the 
vessel. Now let's get back to sign time. I wonder if that uh, old man has anything to say to us now that we did that. Good luck on your mission, friend. He kind of looks like our father. Is he like the non-evil version of our father? Because our, our dad, our father, is definitely the evil version back in Escalio. Thank you, game, for not making us fight 17 dudes on the way out. Ah, oh, Blizzard noise is back, though. Glad doesn't make us walk all the way back. I just realized Alish is wearing high heels. screen an in-game loading screen my PC is outdated oh my PC it can't handle 20 year old game it's dog shit I have to completely scrap it buy a new one I need the GTX 4080 really sometimes it seems to make perfect sense even with Scientine in such a rundown state, you can still see similarities with Illumina. Well, look at us, for example. Us? Yes. You and me. I hate to admit it, but I think we make a good team. And the resemblance is there for all to see. We could be bro Brothers? No thanks. My brother died. Really? You were lucky. My brother's wanted for murder and treason. I guess we won't be playing happy families together. Huh? Wow, that's kind of a dick thing to say. I didn't know. Look, can we move on now? I I'm sorry, but my family life has always been screwed up. I'm sorry, too. Don't be. I intend to have my revenge. I suppose that's not an option for you. What happened? He died in a cutscene. He was murdered by one of the first Eclorian raiding parties. But hey, you were right. This conversation's heading nowhere fast. Let's get back to sign time. That is the first sensible thing you have said all day, brother. My past is catching up to me. Although I removed my shadow in Askelia, 
Perhaps there is still work to be done to prevent the line of Karastan from rising again. Oh, so that's our brother, basically, the evil version of our brother. Sibling cannot be chosen over me. Whatever. I share blood with Kazel. This blood must be spilt. But first, I must find Elko and force him to finish his machine in time for my master's return. Yep, you gotta do that, Talos. Just fucking exposition right there in the corner. Wow. Just as I was thinking, I needed to turn up the volume. Your Majesty, uh, I'm afraid there's been another accident. Uh, sh should we continue? Of course! Look, it is regrettable that such a thing might happen, but our work is not yet done. Oh, send his widow our condolences and get the mess cleaned up. I want all the towers completed and ready for crystal installation as soon as possible. Now get out. I have more important things on my mind other than your staffing problems. Oh my god, she's evil. How could we have known other than all the evil shit she did? When you're ready to see the truth, come and find me in my courtroom and I will prepare the spell. Ah, oh, Elka, where are you gonna go brood off to now? And why is your alternate part like. Oh no, here he comes. Look at him. How can they say I look like him? He walks like an idiot. <laughs> Elko, you are not pleased to see them back? Of course. Uh, it's good. Yeah, it's good. They're safe. Ah, I see. You are worried for what will happen next. All of this, it's, um... Uh, it challenges you, no? It has been a trying time. It's also surreal. I keep expecting to wake up. It's a shame you say that. A dream is a fantastic thing. I used to dream all the time. I was a painter, you see. I saw art all around me. Such beautiful Oh, colors. alternate version of Elko is an artist, I huh? To fade. And I woke up. This is exactly what I'm talking about. I, I try to explain my nightmare and you tell me not to wake up. I've had enough mumbo jumbo. Give me some facts. I didn't want to upset you. We shall see the truth in the morning. Maybe you need your rest, but it's best not to wait too soon. You might find this dream over before you work out how it should end. How come Elko and Buki both got their, like, whole own arc, as did Tao, and Ailish got, like, five minutes of screen time? She was, like, barely on the screen. There she is. It's alive with power. How can something so beautiful be the cause of such consternation? Could consternation? Chill with the five dollar words, Elko. My research didn't indicate anything of the sort. Of course, I only looked at the effect in Askilia. Akorians attribute their misfortunes to anyone but themselves. The brain speaks in riddles just to confuse people. It is the Akorian army that raids our homelands, not the other way round. Come on then, Elko. What are you waiting for? Take it. Take it for Askilia. For Lucica. Was Eilish like the main, main the MC? I mean, you'd think she was since she's on the cover, but no, I guess she's just a side character. Tal is the main character. Oh, damn your eyes, Elko! Where is the courage of your convictions? Wait, I can choose? I, I, I can choose? Well, obviously I'm going to choose to leave the crystal. Elko. Lord Talos, what are you doing? 
doing here? Her Majesty requires your services. I am here to escort you home. home. I'm sure you will be delighted to see how your work progresses in your absence. Oh. Oh, would you look at that? I don't think it mattered if I stole or didn't steal the crystal. Can I play as Talos? No. So if I had chosen not to steal the crystal, would it just be me alone and Italos wouldn't have come? Also, uh, he's very tall. Holy shit. Hope these things work. They're still prototypes. A side note. Well, I must say I'm surprised that you haven't nicked off in the night like your thieving friend. What did she mean by that little outburst? Just what she said. Your friend Elko ran off last night. With the Aclorian crystal. It seems his work comes first after all. Man, you had you had, you had you could have talked no jutsu him. Told you nothing. Let's not jump to any conclusions. Ha! It's admirable that you stand by your friend, but I fear the truth. We are... Oh my god, it's Morgana's arc from Persona 5 all over again. No, I can't do this another time, bro. No. No, not another character throwing a tantrum and then, like, derailing the plot for, like, 20 hours. Don't do this to me. No. Don't do it. I don't even care that much about this character. Ah. Oh, no. Why? Sucked into the little hole. I'm gonna turn sound effects up. I'm sorry, but like, I think it'd be. 
it's so weird how like the audio levels for the main characters are low but everyone else is high but I'm just sick of hearing probably a bit low or a bit high but whatever it's got some Darth Vader vibes going on <laughs> Wait, when the camera you can see, they just get pushed into the little floor below. They don't actually get teleported. I'm actually glad Talos was in the this situation get so out of hand. Imagine having to play the whole game with him just like fucking sucking on his inhaler the whole time. Just Ambush. Wait, Scientine Eyes, didn't I need that for a quest? Free Scientine Eyes, how many do I have? Nine! Oh nice! Good enough for the quest, yay! Well, you know, always gotta find the, the, the you know, the light on the, the, the greener side of things. Was the moon always that big? Talos really sticks to your ass. What's up? What's up to yourself, Troy6912? Welcome to the stream, brother. Please don't say any racial or homophobic slurs. And please don't link a Twitch stream, uh, a tw Twitch bot viewer account. If you're real, I love you. If you're a bot and you're about to drop a link to Twitch viewer account, I'm gonna lose my nut because we've already had two tonight. Also, shout out to people who put numbers in the name of their username because they couldn't get the one that they originally wanted. You know, dude, dude really said, "Damn, Troy got used six thousand nine hundred and eleven times." You know what? I'ma be Troy six nine one two. 
See, that's why I used Dayoni. It wasn't even it wasn't even because this is the one I wanted to use. The username I wanted was already taken. But I refuse to be second. It's either first place or nothing. I'm not going to be username number 69. Sag, so paranoid. I mean, literally every time I get my hopes up, I'm like, oh, we got a real chatter, a second chatter. It was a bot. Can you blame me? I returned the transentine crystal to Illumina on behalf of the professor. Can you blame Your me? Your work is of personal interest to me. Really? I'm just a eepy little kid. As you said, there is no turning back now. <laughs> Whatever keeps Stahl and the others in Scientine, Illumina will always be my first concern. No, that's just my birthday, all oh, hard. At least you're being optimistic. I'm always optimistic, bro. I'm never negative. Simdav Kakurama Ginamaskumra Initas. Was that a real, like, fake language they made? Or was that just the just poisons? Now, we fly with you. Put these boobs like now, on the floor. Now, your eyes shall be opened. Ooh. See how it drains the color away. Keep watching the bow. And you will see where. I think it's Gordy Cooper. I don't even know what that is. See the edge. What the hell is going on? In the realm of shadows, the Shadow Nexus. What the hell is going on? What is this cutscene? Wait, isn't that Illumina? Are, are we gonna go for every floor? Like that machine is part of the problem and not the solution after all. I warned you not to trust the Hikarians. No. Mother, it can't be true. <laughs> Wait, how does that how does that like tell Ailish that her mom is evil? What? Like, obviously, we saw the, like, exposition that she's trying to become immortal, but how does that show that your mom is evil? What the fuck? That was unclear. Whatever. We're just skipping for exposition now. They ain't even expositioning anymore. They're just, like, fast-forwarding. With some interesting pacing. Your good work has redeemed you, Elko. You shall be rewarded handsomely as soon as you complete these final tasks. Infer. This yeah, you just gotta infer what they're saying these days, though, like, what the information is. I mean, they, well, from what I heard, because I looked up some of the development behind this game, they literally caught, like, it was something like 60% of the game got caught from final development. So this is, like, half of what we were supposed to get. The power must flow continuously, or there are great dangers. That is not your concern. You are to follow my orders. Time is of the essence. Forgive me, but without the conduit capable of handling such huge waves of magical energy, the whole system could destabilize, and a crystal that size would be unheard of. <laughs> you scientists are so sure of yourselves, aren't you? A near crystal is nothing when compared to the human soul. You want to use a human? 
That would be suicide! Oh, such intellect marred by such ignorance. The machine will open a portal directly to the void, from where we shall call Haigu himself. Why would you tell him that you're doing evil stuff? Why would you not just keep lying? Will act as a host to the great demon. The pause between the dialogues is the perfect length to just be on the edge of annoying, but still not. Once and I fuck with it. W devs. Then, this, is they, this is how they. This is. This is how dialogue was paced in old video games. You compare this to like how they talk in like The Last of Us, where like people talk like real human happen. beings. But if I turn against the green, I sign my own death warrant. It's insane. Until it I know. Yeah, yeah it's, it's crazy. Because I was, I, I did play The Last of Us too, um, and. Like, okay, I know everyone's like, oh, that's what was too so Look, distract all that part. They talk like real people. Like, they, like, the conversations are not, like, in real life where everyone takes their turn. People talk over each other and there's, like, stuttering and stuff. Whereas, you know, in these RPGs, everyone just... Oh, my God. What are we going to do? I love it, personally. It's very anime-ish. Also, welcome in bundle. Well done. Take this key and go to my chambers on the far side. I don't like the way he said, take this key and go to my room. That sounded a little... I don't know what he's given me. Don't test my pay. But I, I don't know if I want to go in there. Also, I just, like, I didn't really notice before, but he has a... He has a... Ponytail. Don't test my pay. Yeah, I'm just skipping for the die. I'm pretty sure there's like an hour left of this game. So I'm trying to finish this before Spooker starts his Elden Ring stream. Because I'm low-key. I've had my fun. See, this is one thing I like about old games. Everyone like shits on old games. They're like, oh, dude. They only go for like 10 to 20 hours. Dom is live right now. Uh, is he just stalling in... I mean, he's probably stalling intro anyways. Like, I, got, I know I got like a solid one more hour. No, he's not even there. Oh, okay, good. Yeah, we got like an hour of stalling to go through. He's not doing Elden Ring, though. Are you guys actually doing Chain Together? Because as soon as you start, I'm ending stream. And I will be there to see you guys. <laughs> okay, but like, it's not actually annoying. No regular stream tonight on Friday. He's doing Inc uh, Incog. Oh, uh, I was there for last night's Incog stream. I can afford to miss one. I mean, he just does D2 cameras. But yeah, I just want to get another dose of... I'm not frustrated. I'm just annoyed. <laughs> Spooker's movie 2 on a plate. Dude, honestly, I want to get to the point in streaming where I can just leave reruns. Is that not the most based fucking like level of streaming you can get to? You're not even a lot. You're literally the whole point of streaming is that it's like live and interactive, as opposed to TV. Dude, I was laughing at that while editing. Wait, are you editing, dude? That whole segment of like Valley like laughing his ass off and Spook is like, I'm not even frustrated. Like you're not even getting to me. Like I'm not even angry. It's just annoying. That shit was the funniest shit. <laughs> what he, have we here? He's gonna disagree, but I felt that he was so mad. I feel like the rule, the general wait, hang on, the general rule is the more you say I'm not mad, like the madder you are. Wait, does does J young General Arlo not literally look like the Witcher, Geralt of Rivia? <laughs> That's fucked up. He only has a, a picture of his son and his. He left a ten-hour. Is wait? Did he? Get, is he playing that fucking gnome video I had? At spook is fuck you. Hi Jack, can you allow that? Oh, thank you. Thanks, Hydra. He left a ten-hour loop of random gnome sounds and the movie to buffering pause. So now you're just hearing, you're just hearing the oh, oh. Dude, that's premiere content right there. But yeah, back to what I was saying. I feel like the more you say you're not annoyed or you're not mad, then you're annoyed or mad. I mean, I could be wrong, though. 
because I'm often wrong, but I could not stop laughing. Five hours of silence broken by the gnome reverb. I will say though, it you, you know how people talk about like the butterfly effect? He's being provoked. Yeah, <laughs> that was such a and it didn't help that like Angus was like egging Valley on in the background, but um I was thinking about the butterfly effect. <laughs> if roll up, roll up. Oh, I was supposed to go to the castle gardens. If if Angus had beaten the chariot, because Angus got in the chariot, unfortunately, if he had actually made it all the way to the end on his first try, then you would have completed chained together. And then if you had beaten chained together, then Friday would have been open for any gameplay, because you wouldn't be playing Chain Together on Friday. It'd be an open slot. And then, I could have suggested we play Pummel Party, and we'd be doing Pummel Party this Friday instead. But no. A Angus had to choke at the most important part of the game. Nah, Friday will be Elden Ring? It better not. Friday better be fucking, um, uh, welcome to the game, too. Because he still needs to beat that. Dilly, my precious Dilly. We have to go. Go? You've only just come back. What's the matter, darling? I've done something so terrible. Shh, calm down, sweetheart. What's happened? My machine. Lucica isn't interested in storing magical energy for the good of Illumina. She I aims subscribe to, use the power to Spooker. For a reason so terrible, I, I can't stop thinking about it. <laughs> what do you mean? The power is drawn from no, the light it of another been, world. No, I've subscribed to Angus Aquaria. and asked him to be there are condemned to live in darkness. But he said no, Worse and I got still, banned Lucica by a 12-year-old from his chat. all the machine's power into a living being. Lord Talos. Honestly, it's more impressive when you're not but modern why? Angus's chat. She wants AKA to me. In my eyes, he wouldn't give it to me, so it feels bad. <laughs> I, I don't know if I want to be in any stream where Zach is a moderator and I'm do? not. Because if Zach gets modded, I don't. What does Uncle, that say? Are you positive about all this? Okay, yeah, 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 we get it. I only wanted mod, so I'd stop getting... Wait, that's literally why I wanted moderator. I feel like it actually drives away chatters, because if you're not chatting, okay, then you get, get banned. Here. I literally just didn't want to keep getting banned. Holy fuck the dialogue, Stop yeah. He's a saboteur. Stop him by order of the queen. Run! Get your GF out of there, bro. Wait, let's get a good look at his GF. Strong NPC vibes. Mod abuse happens a lot in chat. You hijack your mod in his chat. New chatter experience heavily depends on what mods are in the chat. Yeah, I used to let everyone be mod back in the day, and then I realized that's really bad, and you're just going to get mod abuse. So I only have four mods, and that's it. Yeah, but I don't abuse it. You should. You may as well bot and use a... I may want to speak English. You may as well mod abuse. It's not like anyone else is following the rules over there. So you let Hijack be a mod? That's insane. I trust Hijack because Hijack actually comes to every stream. And I need one person to do the shit that I can't be bothered doing. That's it. That's literally it. Mods are Hijack, Meme Generator. He was my first ever mod and he earned it. Wait, we're killing our own people now. Just to save our GF. Wait, she- wait, do not kill my girlfriend. Holy shit. Ooh, run away! Holy shit, she's standing there! He also has a meme. You almost killed her? Yeah, imagine I actually shot her. Oh, so now there's guards. Like, the five million times you go into the woods and just get attacked. Be careful! Just move! Oh my gosh, she's getting, she's getting fucked up! Oh, 
Oh, it's an escort mission. It's just a straight up escort mission. Shoot her, do it. Wait, does she actually take damage from me? Oh, she doesn't. That's the fucking. I would have definitely killed her by now. At least it gave her like 10,000 health. It doesn't look like she really took much damage. Alright, I'm just gonna... Okay, it is meme on. generated, it's hijacked, and there's Todd. That's it. I don't need... Yeah, I don't need... A... Wait, hang on. I gave Spook his mod. That's right. So four. Meme, hijacked, Spook is Todd. That's it. And that's like my mods after like streaming for like five years. I haven't given anyone else mod. I haven't even given my best friend mod. And he watches my streams from time to time, but he doesn't really mod anyways. One thing I learned is like don't even bother giving your friends a stream. Uh, don't bother giving your friends mod. It's not like they're gonna do anything with it. Dom is a mod on my stream. Re really? Huh. I gave Spookus a mod just because I trust him to like mod properly. Well actually there was that one time no actually no never mind. I was about to say there was a one time you messed up, that was my fault. One time I gave Dom like when I first gave Dom mod, not one time, but I gave Dom mod and then literally he forgot to unban Zack, but then he didn't forget. It was me who forgot to unban Zack, because Dom unban Zack, and then we re Zack. Now re I have learned Zach. to accept that life is nothing without mystery. I will trust in the will of Tetsu. I must hurry to Scientine and my true friends. Yeah, he's VIP. Oh, he finally got... Dude, the, the weird laser <laughs> thing that makes him accept your fate. I see now that the gods themselves need your help. You must get back to the others as fast as you can. You saw Go. that? Nice. I'm still mad that we gave VIP to Angus. Alright, next time we do the, um... Oh, whoops. Oh, my lord, she's gonna die. Alright, I need a nano hands. Okay, time out. I will say, games were certainly, they had a bit of a flare back then. It was just him and chat trolling the votes. Yeah, I actually regret, but, like all jokes aside, I would have preferred it just went to, I think it was you that came second at that point. Just because, well, because like I thought Spookers would just veto. Sorry, like I actually thought he would just veto at the end. I didn't think he was gonna give it to Angus. I feel like there should be a rule that you can't submit something that's not actually a song. Hijack plus troll, yeah, me and Hijack, Haley and, and technically Haley. Well, next time I'm actually gonna submit real music, so I'm actually gonna participate properly instead of just sending like meme songs. Well, I will still submit... I'm still gonna submit the Roblox song, because, you know, you gotta put the Roblox song. 
But other than the Roblox song, that's the only meme song I'm gonna submit. Unless Jay submits it first, because Jay always submits that song too, because he thinks it's funny as well. I mean, it would be easy to help you if you didn't run into it. Kind of messed up, I can't give healing potions to her. I'm sorry, okay, it was funny. I mean, it was funny, though. It was kind of funny. It was like, ha, <laughs> full metal bat. Man, why couldn't he get his ultimate outfit sooner? Because this is like the best looking outfit, but it's like literally at the end of the game. Where is... There she is. I've never actually met a girl named Tilly. Granted, I've also never met a girl, so... Unlucky. I think we only have two more areas to fight through, and then we're pretty much done. Oh, well, unless the game is nice enough to not make us fight through. Oh, wow. Alright, we only got to fight through one area. That area always spawned this enemies, but it didn't make me fight there. Let me stick to the corner. Yes. I dated a girl whose her friends called her Tilly. What is Tilly even short for? Matil oh hope these things work. I literally have never saw that. Like I feel like if you're if you're gonna you know shorten Matilda, you, you call him Matt. Only I mean, Maddie. Oh, but then that's too similar to Maddie, M Mad Dog, Madowski, and that's already pretty generic and overused. I've I've I gotta be real with you. Uh, uh, Maddie and Kayla, Kaylee, those variations. We gotta stop, man. We gotta stop. Just too many Maddie, Ma Kayla, Michaela's, K Kaylee's, just too many. And I say that as somebody whose name is literally Sam. You know, like it doesn't get much more generic. But at least it's so generic that it it's actually like not popular anymore. It started falling because I think there were too many Sams. So see, people stopped using it. But no, no more Maddie's, no more Matilda's. Okay, Samantha. Okay, hi, Jack. Or should I say Jack? Which is short for Jacqueline. Hmm. <laughs> There's a lot of Mikes as well. Michael was not a popular name in my school. We had like All one right. Michael. I feel like Michael kind of is out of the, out of the, out of use now. All right. Name like Siddiq El Tahir, El Fadil El Siddiq, Abdurrahman, Muhammad Ahmed Abel Karim El Mari. Yeah, the 20 long names. I don't know how they do that shit. And honestly, let's be real here. Everyone just shortens it to Muhammad or Mo. 
We had like 10 Muhammads at my school. 10 Muhammads in my year alone. And that was ages ago. Ages ago. Oh, I got you to safety, babe. I'm gonna go fight like evil Jesus now or some shit. You should be safe here. Promise me that you will stay away from the castle. I'll be back for you as soon as I can. I won't leave the house until you return. I promise. Now go. You have a lot of explaining to do to tell. Her mouth's not even moving. I love you too. Shh. You'll be back. I know. Chip down on the animation there a little bit. Oh, okay. Damn. All right, Alka. See you. Chat, how lonely did that just make you feel? On a scale of 1 to 10, be real. Because <laughs> I'm saying, feeling a 10. <laughs> 100? Feels bad. Yeah, 1 million. 1. Based. Andrew. I ain't lonely when I'm with the boys. That's based in Giga Chat as fuck. You know, Spookers was telling me that he actually used to have a second girl besides Haley in his community, but she got, like, removed because of drama. Apparently, she used to, like, argue with everyone or some shit. Don't even remember what her name is. It's hard to believe there was ever, like, a girl in Spooker's stream that discovered it naturally. That wasn't, like, already one of the boys' girlfriends. Like, Haley's obviously, you know, Michael's boyfriend, so obviously she's just here by default but he apparently he used to have like a, a, a standalone female viewer and it fell apart well what yeah ask him next time he, he used to have a there was another girl here she actually used to like participate joining with the boys but some drama happened I can't be fucked explaining it because I've already forgotten like 99% of it but she lost we're asking as soon as he gets back I can't believe you weren't there because me and Ash asked about it we said have you ever had another girl streamer? And he's like, yeah, back in the day, it was like, Hainsey, Ash, and her. And then she, there was some drama, and then she left. So I think, <laughs> I think, <laughs> I think it was drama. <laughs> I think it was drama involving Zach. <laughs> I don't, don't quote me. I might, it was one of the boys she left because of, and I think it was Zach. <laughs> I don't remember who. But there was a drama between her and one of the boys, and she left. I think he said... One of the boys said something, like... And then she didn't like it, and she left. So, like, I mean, odds are, probably, Zach, but one of the boys said it. I don't remember. That rings a bell. It's not that... Yeah, he... Spookers talked about it on stream once, when he was playing Overwatch, because me and Ash asked... I think if she if he'd ever had a girl on the stream besides Haley. Okay, time out. What was the Twitch? I can't remember the name. I just know that she was a girl. It was a long time ago too, apparently. Honestly, with the way our community is, I, I'm not surprised girls didn't last long here. I'm pretty sure we were told about it. Maybe Dom said it to Aeoni. Do we even have new chatters coming in at all? Uh, I'm a new chatter, technically. I've only been here for a year. Wait, I went the wrong way. Wait, hi Jack, come on. You're technically a new chatter too. You shot, you jumped ship from Angus to, to Spookers. Okay, true, you're not wrong. Am I not wrong? Were you not literally like Angus's first viewer and now you're always in the stream?
You've not met anyone IRL, right? Uh, no. Technically, I could meet Ash because we like literally live in the same suburb, but we haven't met up. It's been two years now for Dumbstream. Yeah, I'm probably the newest stream. Uh, I'm probably the newest viewer that's settled in and is like staying around. I don't think anyone's come in since the year I've been here. Me, me. I I, want, I jokingly said to Ash, "Let's go to the anime convention that was in Brisbane." That's the only time I ever offered to meet up. And I only like half-hearted, but we didn't end up doing it. But yeah, we, from what I heard, we're literally like a 10 minute drive from each other. Like, we literally live one suburb next to each other. And we always say like, maybe we'll meet, and then we never do. Guessing you found him through SL? Spookers? Yeah. Pretty much. That's where everyone meets. I literally went all the way to the wrong way again and left. I keep because when you, the camera turns you around, like this. I think everyone met through SCPSL, really. Or at least for most of us. I went I went to Pantheon last night. You know what's funny? I don't know if people know him, but there's uh, this streamer called Geronimoopy, um, who's like a furry VTuber. And he was one of the OGs on uh, Pantheon. Um, and he's like actually doing pretty well. He's got like 50 viewer average on stream. And whenever he hops on, um, whenever, yeah, you know Jero, yeah, anytime he hops on, everyone comes back to SCPSL, like all the old viewers. Because he was playing SCPSL, it was just like he just hopped in to help on when I was playing. And then, um, yeah, like all of a sudden, all the old uh, SCP players are there. But he doesn't really play SCPSL anymore. You know what makes me sad? Um, okay, I don't know how many people know, but there's this guy named Javoiki who used to stream SCPSL. And um, I remember one time, it was kind of mean. But he, he he didn't have a lot of viewers like me, you know, we're both like sub 5 viewers. And he's like, oh, I wish I had SCPSL partner. And literally, um, I think it was Sky, like jokingly said to Javoiki, uh, in order to have viewers, you have to be interesting. I think he said it as a joke, but <laughs> I was like, damn. Javoiki, happy birthday! I know the reference. Oof, yeah. But, like, the thing was, I also personally felt it, because I, too, was there streaming. And I was, I like, I wish I had SCPSL part, and I was like, damn. He just took their ass. That hits hard. Look, I'm of the opinion, just because you have, like, you know, like, a couple viewers, like, ten viewers, that doesn't mean you're not interesting. It just might mean that, unfortunately, you're just not streaming at a good time, or you just haven't had the luck. I don't want to say luck, but I don't think, like, for example, I don't think Angus is not interesting. I think Spookers and Angus are, like, the most interesting stream. They're the only streamers I've watched. There's a reason why Angus and Spookers are the only two streamers I'm currently subscribed to. Or you're playing a bad game. Yeah, like D2. I'm not even joking. If Sp Spook is just perma variety, like meta Twitch grind. Yeah, his when as soon as he touches D2 Overwatch 2, instantly it's like me, Zach, Haley, Hijack, um, <laughs> Sudeki. Yeah, or Sudeki. You decide to play old RPGs from like 20 years ago. But that's the thing. It's the balance between doing what you want to do and doing what Twitch wants you to do. Only reason he has viewers is Lurkus. I actually, unironically, when yeah, Spookus yeah. streams, I always put his stream... Even if I'm not watching, because sometimes I'm already playing a game, or I'm, I'm watching TV, or like, you know, I'm watching something else, I will still open his stream just to guarantee he always has one viewer for me. What? Wait, do you only have 24k from Spooker Stream? That's pretty low. Oh, he's talking my stream. You already got 24k? Damn. Oh, here. I hope you're not farming just for the end stream reward. You know, I'm thinking about... I will always have his stream, Angus, and if you're alive, open as well. Aww. Don't I did the same for you last time you played Rocket you League. Stand a chance attacking Illumina. <laughs> One GG is literally just pattern. all the boys opening each other's stream in like an hey, alternate tab while we're doing our own thing. Illumina, Even if we're not just to like 
The only person I didn't do it for was Jay. Last time Jay streamed, Mean Speakers came in and then I left off to like 20 minutes. Secret viewer farmers. Forgive me, my friends. Aww. You've got to be kidding. You built the machine that plunged us into darkness. You betrayed us all when you stole the crystal. And now you expect us to forgive? I just made the tab, leave it in the background. I, I thought muting the tab lowered the viewer account, so I always just Music set it to 1% volume. Wool over my eyes for long enough. Oh, you, you mute the tab, right not the stream. Yeah, 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 yeah. The That's machine what you mean. is training away your light. But I swear, I had no idea. I'm afraid that's not the worst of it. Lord Talos and the Queen have a plan. The machine is not the peace shield that I believed I was building. It's little more than a generator. They want to create enough magical energy to raise and bind a demon. Those Hygu. goggles are goofy as fuck. Yes, Lucica believes that she can bind Haigu into Talos' uh, body half a million and points the Dark Lord to channel. the plane of men once more. And channel reward next time you get more. Nonsense! Why would Mother want to do that? Immortality. She's scared. Scared of her own mortality. She has watched her own mother waste away, ravaged by disease. And so now she is simply clinging to her kingdom I'm the gonna. only way Good she man. knows how. Good man. If it was a political problem, I suppose she could see a way out. But it's not. It's her life, and the manner of her inevitable death. Ailish, I am so sorry to have to tell you all this. It's gonna be order redeemed, so we can't abuse like we did the last time when we modded and abused multiple it. times. Yeah, he's probably not gonna let that slide anymore. It's taken ten years to build. It's not as easy as pressing the self-destruct button. But, I have bought us some time. Forget about the machine and Lucifer. It's too late. Hi, Goo is coming. This is according to the prophecies of Omnia. Each of you has been visited by Tetsu, and he has granted you the power of his champions. Cariston, Olivetus, Libius, and Mo. I believe that if we're gonna fuse together, those heroes will be reborn in you. Could have used better words. This is but... the will of the gods. It is time to join together. If you are to defeat Haigu, then you must travel to the Void and give praise to Tetsu. In the Void, you will become whole at last. You will be reborn into the life you should have always had. Know that one of you will be chosen as the conduit of Tetsu and will do battle with Haigu himself. The fate of the world will be carried on your shoulders. If you decide to accept the challenge and leave behind the lies you all know, then I will deliver. Wait, is that it? Is that the end of it? Wait, I think this is it. I'm pretty sure this is the end of the game from what I recall. Because I played this as a kid 20 years ago. I was like, I don't even know how old I was. I think. We can end. We, we go to the final boss. Imagine he comes back to the train scene if he takes that long. Hey, where am I? We are in the realm of shadows. The Shadow Nexus is the gateway to the Void. Tetsu will open the path into the Void for us. There we will merge. Oh yes, Let's touch go. each other. To begin the ceremony, we must give praise and thanks to Tetsu. Um, I praise Tetsu, Elko. Uh, I praise Tetsu? With conviction, man. You're talking directly to God. I praise you, Lord Tetsu! 
I praise you, Tetsu! I still can't get over the fact they made the evil versions of our characters Australian. I, I give thanks to Tetsu the Unifier. Praise unto him, Tetsu, Guardian of Sadeki. Praise to Tetsu. Um, praise to, a uh, Tetsu? Second age of unity, unity. Your destiny awaits, awaits. Joy with your shadow, shadow. Oh, refusing. Oh, refusing some more. Dramatic. It's so extra. I miss this. I miss the games being so, so over dramatic, over the top, so extra. Buki? I am whole at last. Nico, you will forever be in my reflection. Your arm! What? <laughs> oh, oh, is that Lucica? Is it the Queen? Oh, Luke. Huh? Don't look. Talos, what have you done? The prophecy will not come to pass. I am the living embodiment of Haigu. You are but slaves to the light. This marks the beginning of the eternal night. Then we are too late. I call upon the powers of separation to destroy the lines of Karastan, Olivetes, Libius, and Mo. Now and forever. Damn. Together, but we will not be thwarted. I have the dark powers of Haigu pulsing through my veins. Which one of you is the conduit of Tetsu? Ours is an old score to settle. Wait, why do we have to one v one? Tell, don't die. I'll try not to. Why do we have to 1v1? Kazal was my brother, and now he is part of you. Have you the heart to kill your own flesh and blood? You? You don't understand what it means to have a brother. Oh, but I do. I know that your brother cried out your name when I slit his throat. Who will cry out your name, Talos? I weep for no one. And no one weeps for me. That was dramatic. Oh, 
got him. Let me get some of that. Oh, it does work. Will I, or am I about to pop the fuck off? Let me hit you with one of these. Okay, the 17 cutscenes is getting a little low. Get play dance, get play dance, get play dance. Spamming my ultimate abilities like the chat I am. <laughs> Why do you get like seventy of these? I'll play. You can't keep us apart anymore. I praise you, Tetsu. Oh, okay, we're just going Super Saiyan now.
And so the fable fell into the past. Sudeki was born bright at last. When truth is sought, the truth will out, and brightness cast the darkness out. Know thyself with all your faults, and all before you will see you as you truly are. Yay, we did it, we beat the game. That's it, that's literally the end of the game. Because, also, one downside of games from the 2000s, they just abruptly ended. They just said, yeah, you beat the final boss, that's it. There's no, no resolution, no, like, you know, wow, what a great, just over credits, roll credits. They really didn't overstay their welcome. I think, honestly, this game, you could tell they really did cut 60% of its content. It's crazy how, like, abrupt the ending is. On a side note, the Bink Video JPEG in the bottom right corner is like very interesting. Um, another thing I don't understand about the credit scene is um, why uh, why is the credit scene just set in that um, that mermaid cave? Like, I thought they were gonna cycle through, you know, each each like area. Like, oh, here's the mermaid place, and then here's bright water and here's the shadow realm and and the castle and blah 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 nah over here the game is just like nah fuck it bro just here here's one one image of one area and it's over look how short the credits were too like legit 30 seconds and then it's just done and that's Sudeki it's already over. It's already over. And then they kick you back to the main menu. I remember this being pissing me off. But, you're in luck, chat. You are in very good luck. Because, I thought the credits would be way longer. Yeah, I mean, that's the one thing about games back then, is that the, the devs, the, the studio, they like, they cleared it up. But don't worry, there is something that is quite nice, that I actually enjoyed about this game is that uh, somebody went through and re-uploaded cut content and they actually uploaded um, the, the the cut ending the bonus ending that actually like gives us some closure so thankfully we don't have to sit here and just be like wow it's just over and we didn't get anything luckily for you uh, I found this, and that's good, because if we had just ended on that, that would have been depressing. But all these years later, we get a proper ending, uploaded by someone who I'm pretty sure was probably, like, actually one of the developers themselves. So let's check it out. Let's see the proper endings. It's not voiced, though. Well, it's, it's semi-voiced. So there's the animation, they blow up the evil bad guy, yay, we won. There's this shit. Turn the volume up a bit. Victory is ours. True champions, I mean, this shit, you have released myself from purgatory and defeated my brother Hager. Each of you has fulfilled the destiny for a totem legend. Now it's up to each of you to start a new chapter in your lives. Wherever you go now, you have Tetsu and the spirits of Omni at your side. Walk with me in your heart. Behold, the second age of unity. Your task is ended as mine has begun. I will reach out into the stars and bring uh, Lumina and whatever together. The one true planet arises from the ashes once more. I know my path. I must go back to the realm of shadows. This was never meant to be my home. And besides, my people need me. What about you then, Elko? Do you know, this machine was my life's work. What will you do now? What will I do? That's easy. Something more important. Something much more important. Buki, Tal, Eilish, I must go. I'm late to see my wife. About five years late. And Elko runs off. And then we pan and blah 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 blah.
And so light returned, evil guy dead, everyone merges together, because... And, and there you go, he runs back to his wife, who is pregnant. I'm guessing he got her pregnant at some point. And everyone's all happy and shit, and blah blah blah. Where to now? We have a whole new world to it. And then we'll... There's the other ending, so we managed to piece together the last part. Go on, Eilish. Tal, I'm so <laughs> glad you're alive. So am I. Oh, excuse me. Yes, yeah, so Tal and Eilish get together. Well, <laughs> Tal, don't you play hero next time? But hey, you did well. <laughs> We have a new world to go back to. Yes, let's go! So then, how are you gonna cope with not being a princess anymore? I might just rock it with you commoners for a while. And there it is. There's the ending. The proper ending. That someone was kind enough to upload and half model, but at least we got the actual voice models and ending. Now I can die peacefully. The only part I like with this game is the lack of a product ending. This is much better. Yeah. So, Sudeki is over. Um, we're done, though. I'm going I'm to give my thoughts on the game. Wait, there was a credit theme? This is not... Oh, it's the same... Uh, let's just put in... Here we go. And I'll give my final thoughts on the game while this is playing in the background. Um... I mean, I gotta be real. It's obviously pretty rough. Like, it's an old-ass game, so it's... It's pretty rough. It's pretty rough. And there's... Definitely a lot of rough edges showing. I didn't 100% complete the game. There are quite a few quests I'm fairly certain I missed, but I don't really regret not like going in and finishing them, just because I didn't particularly care. I, I was kind of done at the end. I do think that the game is like 80% good, and then you get to the Shadow Realm part, and it's just clearly not fleshed out, and it's kind of in a rush to just end. So you just kind of get this 20% at the end of the game that like is clearly dragging out, and the um, the developers just want it to be over with. They're just like done. They don't want to keep going anymore. Well, that's not fair to say to them because, as like I said, I think like 60% of the game got cut. But I will say, for what it is, it's almost like a really fun demo that lasts like what 12 to 10 hours at best, probably longer. You can grind to get to level 30. The game does give you a level 30 grind option. Like, you could have just grinded to your level 30. I can't imagine bothering to do that. Yeah, it's literally a 12-hour tech demo. Um, with that being said, a fun fact about this game, because I did do a little research. This was an Xbox exclusive title, and uh, this game was released as an exclusive to the Xbox uh, to try and compete with Final Fantasy. Um, obviously, pretty clear which franchise succeeded and which didn't, because they never made another game. Uh, and not only that, but the studio that made this, Climax Studios, they went on to make um, some of the modern Silent Hill games, and then they make VR games. They're not the real studio anymore. They got like bought out, and they still technically exist, but it's not the true Climax Studios. And now they just work on VR titles. Uh, apparently, they did actually assist in the creation of uh, Half-Life Alex, which is on Steam. That VR game, yes, that Half-Life. Um, but other than that, they never really did anything ever again, uh, which makes me a little sad. I would uh, say, like, I I wish this game had been more successful just because more JRPGs needed to be on the Xbox, but I'm not surprised. There's so much from this game that is clearly missing. <laughs> Why did they zoom in on Kama's face like that? Uh, the combat is kind of ass. The combat's kind of shit, like... They could have put more effort into the combat. They didn't really. You have like 
a really, really floaty, half-assed first-person shooter, and a really, really basic melee system and nothing in between. And the characters are like, they clearly like pulled archetypes, you know, they got the animal girl, the, 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 the princess, the hero, and the nerd science guy. So like, even the characters themselves, individual. The interesting thing about this game is I like it as a whole, but like, you could pick out any specific individual part and it would be kind of like almost average to below average on its own like the music isn't like above average like i'd say it's okay-ish like i i, I said the the soundtrack is okay but that's when it's paired with the uh, visuals the visuals i mean 20 years it still holds up pretty decently but it's pretty rough in areas especially in the cinematics the combat is like average below average everything about this game i learned and that's this sounds really harsh everything like individually when you look at it in a vacuum is either average or below average but somehow when you put it together it's in my opinion slightly above average pretty decent and it's i think it's worth like just a fun like frolic i don't think it's like you have to ever play this game obviously no one ever has to play this game it didn't really do anything to grab like anyone's attention but I had fun with it. And I think that's all that really matters, if you had fun with the game. The story is generic. And the fact that the game doesn't come with an ending and you have to YouTube the ending is so messed up because you you have to look up the ending yourself. Otherwise, you just get like a really short, abrupt cut scene and a poem, which is like ass. Um, I will say, though, my god... Buki and Ailish are like two of the hottest character models I've ever seen. I'm just gonna say it. This game is carried by Buki's ass. I'm just, I just personally think that's that's one of the best parts of the game. It's just staring at Buki and Ailish's ass. I'd like a Sudeki too. We're never gonna get a Sudeki too, but I liked it, and I don't think it overstayed its welcome. I was like, at the very end, I was bored with it, and then the great part is that. You could just end. We, I could have gone and explored the world more and like done a final, you know, explore session and, and you know done every nook and cranny. But I was like, fuck it, I'm done. I can just gonna finish the game. If I ever feel like coming back to this, I'll come back to this. Overall, I'm gonna give this game a. I'm gonna give it. Maybe I'm overrating it a little bit. I'm gonna give it a three out of five. I think three out of five is fair. I mean, three out of five is very, you can disagree with you, but I, I ultimately, I had more fun than I didn't have fun with this game. Um, so yeah, I'm going to leave it there. And I'm actually going to end stream. Technically, I'm supposed to go for three hours, 20 minutes, but whatever. We finished the game, and we finished where I wanted to finish it, so I'm happy with that. Um, next series we're probably going to do, I'm going to be real. I'm going to look into either doing Final Fantasy or Yakuza. Uh, so please feel free to leave a comment if you want to see Final Fantasy or Yakuza because we're going to do another big series next. I'm also going to start playing the Final Descendant because the boys are currently playing that. Um, but that'll be just out of a side thing, not like the main game. But uh, glad we got through this one. I will upload the finals of these videos as long as um, the rest of the cassette beasts over the week. And then we will try to jump into the next series. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this stream. I'm going to end it there. Did anybody want to have any final words before I said goodbye? Because if not, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say goodbye there. And we're going to say goodbye to Sudeki. Alright. You guys take care and enjoy the rest of your night. I'm going to catch you guys on Spooker's stream anyways. I'm pretty sure he's swapped over to live now anyways. But um, thank you for dropping by. The drill rap. Shout out to all the boys who came by. Because I appreciate that. Alright, peace out. Bye!